platform, which is part of Cupid Sessions, is another project that Central Martins has undertaken with Argent LLP, who is a property developer for King's Cross Estate. King's Cross wanted to do a series of outdoor activities that enliven and activate and draw new types of audiences um, to their spaces. And we wanted to build on a project we did last year called Panamonium and make something that was a fusion between art and design and street culture and hip hop. We again continuing our relationship with choreographer and director Ivan Blackstock. We programmed a series of kind of more artistically driven performances with stage design created by students and graduates from St. St. Martins. But also in parallel, we've created a virtual reality 360 degree movie, which is a representation of a show that Ivan is already creating. So how this all came about was um, with Central St. Martins, they presented me a concept, a festival concept, and see if I could um, attack that brief. And um, the idea I kind of came up with was to create a really interesting and bespoke street culture event. So with all the designs that you've seen has been designed by students from Central St. Martins, we had a really interesting installation. Was it designed by uh, Sherry Lau and Sean So from Central St. Martins? And the whole kind of experience was kind of um, led by Jocelyn Anquatil and the UAL um, alumni, Charles Harrop Griffiths. The main focus was to really showcase British talent, especially within street culture, and also giving platform for students from Central St. Martins. And we kind of went through a kind of a selection process of the best um, students that's coming out with the most cutting edge kind of designs and ideas. It's such a new uh, platform to base things on that it's nice to be there kind of testing different waters in different industries, such as performance dance. It's definitely really exciting to have your work here in King's Cross. In Cross Platform, we bring you different takes on what contemporary street culture is through technology, music and dance. Everyone's kind of been smiling, laughing, the acts have been great. But to be honest, that wouldn't have been the case if it wasn't for the designs and the backing from the students and Central St. Martins. Cubit Sessions has had a, a real mixture of programming, so we've had some opera and other uh, classical performers. And the Central St. Martins nights are really good because they bring in a different audience or appeal to a different audience who are here. So it's a really reflective of the different type of people who are here in the development, who live here, work here or live in the local areas. These type of events make the public feel like we're more accessible to them. They can get involved, they can join in, they can, they can meet students, they can, they can meet staff and like have a conversation with them in a, in a bit more of a relaxed environment. 